The state capitol where the clock is ticking down to the end of the state legislature's 2021 session. 11 Alive's Doug Richards is omnipresent and he's keeping track of what has passed, what failed and everything in between in a way that only Doug can. So yes, uh, some of the, if you say so, some of the uh, most controversial legislation has already passed like the election bill, but the final day of the legislative session in Georgia is always very closely watched because Lawmakers over the years have been inclined sometimes to drop unexpected goodies into pieces of legislation at the last minute. Lieutenant Governor and former pro baseball player Jeff Duncan threw an outside strike to start the final session of the Senate. And the Senate proceeded to pass 17 bills before it broke for lunch. Included was a measure that allowed homeschooled children to participate in public school extracurricular activities, an issue that had stalled at the Capitol for years, but passed easily once it finally got unbottled. A bill also passed targeting porch pirates, a measure passed allowing year-round daylight savings time, though Congress would have to approve it too. A bill passed allowing college athletes to make sponsorship money, and a bill passed the House to create a state course showing young motorists how to interact with police. It had easily passed the Senate, but was surprisingly contentious in the House. You know, if you get up every morning looking for something that offends you, guess what? You're going to find it. Democrats had argued that the uh, new law uh, actually takes uh, police officers off the hook for behaving badly. And when I say law, I mean bill. It's not a law yet. Uh, it actually goes back to the Senate. If they can get it passed between now and midnight, one other point to note, uh, the legislature gave final enactment to a bill that repeals the 1863 citizens arrest law. Uh, Georgia is apparently the first in the nation to repeal such a law. Back to you.